What's up, everyone? Happy Monday. Monday fun day. All right. We're down here at Bay Park. And today feels like the hurricane. Yesterday, no wind, no nothing. Everyone's all scared. And today, super windy. I'm hiding behind this tree here trying to stay out of the wind so you guys can hear me. Pretty sky, though. It's raining again. You guys, a duck there behind a tree here. There's Benny. What's up, bro? Let me hear again complaining about the dog. Like crap laying around. It's not right. Don't be one of those people that throws your garbage out the window and leaves it behind. Carry in, carry out. Yeah, I don't know, right? Barbecue's here. Get some uh, breakfast going. Such a beautiful spot. People rowing it, but leaving that junk around. All right. Monday edition in the rain. Hopefully it's not too windy. I don't know. I'll try and cup this thing in here. Can you hear me? Is it uh, too windy? I don't really have a choice here. I would hide behind this tree. So... Today, I opened up my Bible app, and it was the book of Proverbs, and it was about searching for wisdom, that we must search for wisdom, and we must avoid the distractions and all the things that steal our wisdom. Sound is good? All right, good. I'm afraid it gets too windy. So, um, yeah, so the book of Proverbs is that we must constantly search for wisdom, which uh, aligns with uh, the Apex message. Um, but with that, uh, Ryan's podcast came on and he was talking about how we need to avoid lying, how we need to avoid lying. So we combined the two of those and we learned that, uh, as we search for wisdom, um, by us not using that wisdom, we're lying to ourselves. That's what I'm thinking of this. That's why that showed up today. Right? So we're searching for wisdom. We all know the right thing to do. Right? We all have wisdom that we've gained through life, yet sometimes we choose to lie to ourselves and not follow that wisdom. And we know the outcome, yet we do it anyway. Um, you know, if you think about it, we're guilty of it. We know when uh, we're supposed to do our workout and we don't. Um, we know that uh, we're supposed to do a task and we don't. We have the wisdom. You know, the wisdom's there. We have it. We just don't follow it. So think about it this week. Uh, keep hunting for wisdom, but follow that wisdom. The wisdom is no good if you don't follow it. If you lie to yourself and don't follow it. Uh, the other part is lying, is lying to everyone else. Lying that, you know, you're going to do something. Lying that you've done something. Uh, Ryan explained that when you lie, uh, it's a made-up story that you've never experienced. So by lying, uh, you don't know the details of the story because you've never lived it. In a real-life story, you know every detail because you lived it. And a lie, it's completely made up, so there's no details, you didn't live it. So that makes it stressful for you to keep the lie going. So it's easier just not to lie, just be real. Um, you know, a lot of people lie to each other because uh, they don't want to tell them the truth. We lie to our kids saying, uh, you know, good job, when they really didn't do a good job. You know, this, this world where uh, everyone gets a participation trophy, you know. We need to be real, we need to tell the truth. We need to not sugarcoat stuff, because that's the only way you grow. Way you grow when you face reality so yeah so it's um two good messages today we must constantly search for wisdom um that's our life life goal is to constantly search for wisdom constantly learn constantly grow and we need to take that wisdom and not lie to ourselves and we need to implement that wisdom we need to put everything we learn to work uh, i'm guilty of myself i mean this the amount of knowledge i learned through apex group is amazing yet yeah. Sometimes uh, I fall back into the old routines and I don't do what I'm supposed to do. And not that it's bad things, but it's just not doing the things that I've been trying to excel at. Um, we call doing the work, calling the leads, all that good stuff that uh, we preach at Apex. Sometimes uh, force of average gets you. And rather than calling the leads and rather than doing the work, uh, we take the easy road out and we lay down on the couch and go to sleep and whatever else. So uh, it's a constant battle. It's a constant battle. But, 
uh, when you focus on the good things, you focus on the wisdom, you focus on uh, doing what's right, you focus on being truthful to yourself and to the world, um, that's how you grow, that's how you grow. So this week, it's Monday, it's a new week, it's a new start, thank God it's Monday, because God woke me up again to try all over. So that's the message. Let's jump into prayers. I'll give you something to look at here. It's better than looking at my big head here. now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. All right. Dear God, thank you for a new week, a new opportunity uh, to go out and change the world, to gain some more wisdom, to follow that wisdom. Um, thank you for all the people in my life that constantly help me grow, help me push me to another level. Um, thank you for all the love in my life. Uh, we got the hat on today from my new friend Josh. Spread love, spread love. Uh, help us share God's love. That's our mission in life, to live as God would want us to live. Um, spread love every day and be a prophet. So, all right, everyone. I gotta get on the ride. I gotta get to work. We got a closing today. Uh, fun closing today. It's um, my friend John and Aaron Batanti are buying their home in Malvern two years ago. I rented them a home and they were, he's a Marine and in that Marine life every two years or so they get a new station and they got to move to a, a new location, to a new base, to a new mission. And uh, when they came to Malvern and we got to know each other, I kind of said to, my, to myself, it's my goal to get them to stay here because uh, they're good people and I like being around them. And today uh, we're closing on a house. John decided that he liked Malvern and the community so much. And Aaron, that um, this is where he was going to retire, and this is where he was going to raise his family, and it's a really cool story for me, for them. Um, they're going to be my neighbors. They're literally, if I look out the back window of my house, I can see their house. So super excited about that. Great people. Um, and then the seller, Nancy, um, she's been here 40-something uh, years, and uh, we've become friends in this process, and uh, it's uh, she's really cool people, and I'm so happy for her that she's able to... Uh, they're moving down to Florida, uh, get away from the winters, um, and we're going to miss her. Um, I wish I had known her sooner. We only met a couple months ago, and she's a neighbor around the block, but uh, really cool people, and I uh, appreciate her. So, Nancy, um, thank you for the friendship, and I'm happy we helped, and John and Erin, um, congratulations on your new home. Happy to have you guys as neighbors. So, all good stuff, starting out the week with some fun and some good stuff. So. All right, everyone, go out there, set some goals for the week, hit them, gain some wisdom, gain some knowledge, and use that wisdom and knowledge. Don't lie to yourself. Don't can't that wisdom and sit on it. Put the wisdom into action. All right, everyone, God bless. Kick off Monday in the right way. Oh, tonight, 8.30, we're going to stream again with Sam, Samuel Smith. We're doing our live podcast. Uh, we're going to be doing that Zoom and streaming on Facebook. Hopefully, I can get it to work this time. Um, if not, you'll see the replay. But uh, we're going to try and spread some, uh, spread some love, spread some knowledge, and give you guys some wisdom uh, from stuff we've learned along the way, along our journey. So tune in tonight, 8.30 Eastern Time. Me and Sam Smith are going to try and bring you some more wisdom. We'll fill that head up of yours. All right. So, all right, everyone. God bless. Happy Monday. Go get something done.